When it comes to balancing your life and your day-to-day -day job, struggling is not a strange or unusual thing to happen. There are millions of people who suffer from it all over the world, and they wonder if technology is to blame, and if there is anything they can do to stop it. The truth is that technology is not the main reason they can't balance their work and personal lives well. The tools that can help you deal with the problem were made by Marcus Aurelius, Xenon of Citium, and many other Stoics more than 1,800 years ago. Stoicism has taught us many things that we can use in many parts of our lives, and one of these is how to find the right work-life balance. Pay attention and jot down what you're about to be told because these are 10 steps you must follow exactly as written to keep a good balance between work and life. Ignore the things you can't change because they won't give you any type of value, and instead concentrate on the things you can control. Spending time worrying about things you can't change will only make you angry, because you won't be able to change anything. Remember to stop doing that every time you catch yourself doing it. 2. Be honest about what you expect. This doesn't mean you shouldn't have big dreams, but you should make sure you can reach the goals you set for yourself. It comes down to the same thing as the last point. You will feel bad even if there's no reason to because you're not where you thought you'd be if you don't get where you told yourself you would. Setting goals for yourself that force you to give it all is the best thing you can do because you'll be putting yourself in a tough situation. If you do what you told yourself you had to do and work as hard as you can, winning will feel even better than it did before. You will feel even worse about it though if you don't do the work. 3. Learn to be mindful. By being mindful, you don't think about what could have happened in the past or what will happen in the future. You just live in the present. Focus only on what needs to be done right now at work and in your daily life, and you'll see how this helps you do better. Keep in mind that this doesn't just mean to stop thinking about the past and the future. It also means to focus more on the present. Concentrate every minute like a Roman, like a man, on doing what's in front of you with precise and genuine seriousness, tenderly, willingly, and with justice, and on freeing yourself from all other distractions while you're working. Marcus Aurelius wrote in Meditations, Never go do something that has nothing to do with your task. People in this world will try to stop you from reaching your goals and living the perfect life you want. Do not let it happen. Big companies work on making apps that are highly addictive and will make it hard for you to get back to your task because this needs to be made clear. It wouldn't help to stop thinking about the past and the future and only focus on the present if you wasted all your time on social media. 4. Put limits on things. Try not to mix your work time with the rest of the things you do in your daily life. Instead, set specific times for yourself. This will help you feel more at peace with yourself and give you a sense of order. Make sure you work from 9 a.m. to 12 p.m. if your timetable says so. You will start to notice that every time you complete a task that you set for yourself, you will feel a tremendous sense of accomplishment. This will eventually turn working into a very pleasurable activity. 5. Take care of yourself. Understand that you are not perfect and never will be but appreciate yourself for the work you are putting in. This will make you feel better about yourself and help you do better in everything. People have feelings. Harness this to your advantage and you will become an unstoppable force. Also, remember to be thankful. No matter what religion you follow, Christian, Muslim, agnostic, or atheist, appreciate the fact that you're alive and that you can change anything that happened in the past. Feel good about yourself and know that you have time to do things right. Be glad that you're here to do them. 6. Write down how you're doing. When people are not working, it is common for them to question whether they are working hard enough. It's not easy to turn your mind off and leave it alone. People are much more complicated, so if you don't want this to happen, you should keep track of everything you've done. If you ever feel like not enough is being done, this will help you calm down. Again, recognizing how far you've come is very important, and it will be one of your best tools to avoid thinking about work when you're not supposed to and feeling mentally exhausted. 7. Work out regularly.
Training is something that many people don't pay attention to because they only think about the health benefits of exercise. The truth is that the mental benefits are more common than the physical ones. When we train, our minds become calmer, and we stop thinking too much. Anyone who already does it and doesn't believe it can try it for themselves and find out the truth. Avoid any type of activity that requires you to make a physical effort for a week. You will start to notice how your brain fog becomes more common and persistent than it was when you were regularly exercising. On the other hand, if you don't work out regularly, you should start right away. There are a lot more problems that come from being lazy than you might think. 8. Don't judge other people. Avoid any type of comparison with anyone who is not you, as each of us is unique. There will always be someone who is more successful than you at work, and constant comparison will only make you an unhappy person, as it will turn you into a person who is never satisfied with the work that you are doing. If you want to avoid this behavior at all costs, you should not do it. The only person you need to beat is the one you were yesterday. Try to be the best version of yourself you can be. That will be enough. As Stoics, we must understand and accept that each of us is unique, following his own path, and that we are the only ones who should write the history of our lives. 9. Learn to be patient. To be patient is a very useful skill. By putting so many obstacles in your path, life will try to beat you down. Whether you like it or not, you will need to be able to wait long enough to understand when to do something and when not to do it. 10. Make things easier. Get rid of everything that isn't good for you. Follow your schedule and work timeline more easily. The Your work-life balance will be healthier, and it will be easier to complete your task-related tasks. Be aware that people are complicated and try to make your work-life balance as easy to understand and follow as you can. Once more, these are 10 things that no stoic should miss. Stoicism emphasizes mental fortitude from the first point to the last. And just like having a good balance between work and life, these tips will help you become the best version of yourself. That good balance between work and life will happen on its own. So, for the final time, remember that you will do well in the future, both in your personal life and at work, as long as you go easy on yourself, accept both your good and bad qualities, and understand that everything will be okay. Until the next time.